Okay, we are back. This time we go up uh, here. Yes, we do. Okay, this cave wasn't very exciting. I, this part of the cave wasn't very exciting. I was right. Still, it's important to know. I mean, there wasn't like there was going to be much up here because, you know, I just said it, it's up here. Things get more interesting the lower you go. Though, um, Though, you know, after the caves update, those particular statements might not be necessarily as true. As things get more and more... Well, I mean, things will still be... Well, I mean, that'll still be true, but things will get much more, uh... Dangerous down there, you know what I mean? What the hell do I have that in my head? Eh, oh, whatever. Anyway. Oh, sorry, mumbled to myself there. Right. Okay. No, not the bed. We need the bed. Okay. We don't need the seeds. Why do we even have... Uh, I mean, I know how we got seeds, but why do we even have them? Mm, that should be lit up a little. Yeah. Hello there. You're a zombie. But I have the high ground. You know, certain memes about certain movies aside, high, high grounds in general are actually quite efficient to have in a, in a battle. You know? I mean, I don't know if it really would apply to a lightsaber duel, but whatever. That's kind of beside the point. You know, if you have the high ground in a battle, you're more likely to win the battle, right? Because you have higher ground. That means that you have a tactical advantage, you know? Because you can attack them, and what are they going to do? You've got the cover of the high ground. I mean, it's not like they could magically scale the wall. 
so any so you know I think that's why a high ground in a lightsaber duel is kind of a strange thing because like I mean Anakin tried to do it but yeah you can just move right My god, I've started rambling about Star Wars. Memes as well. You ever watch that, the Clone Wars? You know, that was an interesting one. I mean... It really went somewhat more, it really thought somewhat more about the moral implications of creating an entire group of people just to fight some robots in a pointless war. Although I guess that they didn't know it was pointless at the time. And then there's the fact that, you know, those particular people were actually created for nefarious purposes. Secretly. Although no one, none of them were aware of it. Well, fives was at the end, and that's why he was killed. Four fives. Okay, I'm rambling about all kinds of stuff. Okay, that was a perfect amount of axe left. Good. Oh, and we're at the end of the cave. I guess this cave wasn't as interesting as I'd have hoped. I mean, there's zombies somewhere around here, but... Even if we find them, that wouldn't be this cave. Okay, this way. Light. Okay, I'm gonna go back up. And we're gonna get some stuff offloaded up there. Uh, we wanna keep mining. Oh, fuck. Okay, I said do we want to keep mining and the game nearly tried to kill me, so I'm going to take that as a no. Yeah, to be honest, I don't feel like there's much, there's nothing more to explore here and we could go looking for that zombies, but I can't really, but I don't really want to do that. So, finishing the, finishing this cave, the, uh, you know, dangerous cave. Intense cave is what it was called. Stone, aka seashore's wall. Okay, we're just going to... Okay, next time we wait for all of what's left of this to finish cooking and then we're uh, going to leave the intense cave. See you then.